Cool. Okay, hey, welcome everybody. We are here in Missouri. Yeah. Today we visited the MO GameCon, the Ooh. Missouri Game Convention, uh, just outside of St. Louis, and I think it's actually in St. St. Charles. We still have to see the arch. Yeah, I'm actually yeah. not very sure where we're at. Yeah, we're. Is, is it a different state? Is it <laughs> Illinois? Is it Illinois? Or is it? It's a... No, no, it's it's Missouri. But oh, yeah. St. Louis does border I Missouri, know. and East St. Louis is in Illinois, so it's kind of. You don't never know when you are. Well, yeah, 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 that's the only reason I had to ask him. Like, oh, yeah, we're fucking. But uh, yeah, Go today. Hots, but St. Louis. <laughs> <laughs> all right, today uh, joined by Zach and Art. Uh, we well, all went together, and George is off somewhere also, and he went with us too. Twin Cade um, forever. But, uh, yep, there's George. Oh. Uh, yeah, so the convention was a lot of fun, and uh, today we're going to show you me and Art's uh, game pickups. Oh, man. Yeah. As always, right, per usual, uh, yeah. me and Philip went all goo goo gaga over the gaming collection. Yep, got some, got some good stuff. So, uh, yeah, let's take a look. This shit should be called Inbox Out of Box. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> also, I don't know if you guys uh, noticed, I'm wearing a toga. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Art is wearing a toga. <laughs> and why? It's Toga Time TV. Toga, it's Toga TV. Make yeah. sure to go to YouTube and subscribe to Toga Time TV. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Turtle Time TV. Yeah, you won't find it. I'm going to grab my game. Turtle Time. Yeah, if you want to see more of Art, anyway, you can definitely check out Turtle Time TV. And, of course, you know Art on Twincadia. Ah. And, yeah. I don't want to spoil all that, All that good stuff. Yeah. Cool, okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh, you want to start? Or should no, I start? you got to start because you got the games. You got okay. games uh, in the joint. All right, Art. Game let's... Joint. Well, I'm going to start with it. I'm going to start with this one because uh, just because... Uh, I'm such an NES head, like, when the label's nice, it comes with a manual, I've only heard so much about this game, and then you tell me that it's, like, four different styles of gaming in one. Uh, Goggo 13, has anybody ever heard of it? No. Oh, it's pretty sick, dude. It come, it, look at the manual condition, too. Are you kidding me? Yeah, you be careful, though. I'll, I'll, you be careful. <laughs> uh, no, like, I, I walked up there and I, I seen it, it was $8, $8, the label is amazing, I hope it's not a reproduction cartridge, for God's sake, because like I I did see a table that was like all reproduction cartridges, and I was like, no. Yeah, there'd be no reason to repro. That's pretty common, but this one. Yeah, yeah. Oh. But uh, I've never played it, but I hear it's a good game. Yeah, no, but like, I I, yeah. I have heard a little bit about it, and once I seen it, I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I have to get this. So immediately, should well, how should to I... play a fucking thing in the booklet is ridiculous. They literally, it's. Three paragraphs on how to play, and it's the most elaborate shit I've ever I'm seen. I'm blind on my life. left eye, so I can't read. Mm -hmm. There's no way you're going to read this and not know how to play this game. <laughs> <laughs> Should I do two at a time? Like, let Oh, no, we both bought the same amount of games. Yeah, I got pretty close to the same amount. I, I think I picked seven games up, and you picked nine up, right? Book, uh, and, the, and the game with the label yeah, is, like, in such great condition. Yeah, it looks pristine. What, it looks really nice. What was that really game nice. you got where the box was so crispy? Oh, uh, that, it's something I picked up, up at MGC, right? right? No? Hmm. Yeah, I don't remember. But we were tripping out how nice yeah. it was. I was like, what the fuck? It looks like no one ever touched this box. But go ahead. I'm so sorry to yeah. interrupt. Well, no, no. What I picked up, uh, I'm just going to randomly grab them out of here. Uh, oh. First thing is Robotron 64, which I've never played this. Uh, of course, we have Robotron at Twin K, the arcade cabinet. So Yeah, check uh, out the back. Uh, yeah, yeah. It'll it looks, show you right there. Like, you get a, it's looks like a pretty dope. view. I had Robotron X for the PlayStation, which was obviously. Well, it's probably the same it's, game. It's the exact but, same game. Yeah, yeah. But since that was N64, they, they obviously had to throw 64 in it. Super Mario yeah. 64, everything X Racer 64, like whatever. Super but like Super that, Super that Super literally, Super. it's like I was telling you earlier. They were like, "How do we improve on Robotron? We can't just make it 3D." And that's why I told you, you George. I'm pointing at George when I point that way. He would love the shit out of this game. It's 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 Robotron. But yeah, yeah. fucking a. tight. Can't wait to play it. Yeah. What else you got? Oh, I got a uh, world class track meet with the instruction booklet. I'm like, maybe I'll start collecting instruction booklets too since, I don't know, Philip is a, kind of a large influence on my NES lifestyle. And uh, since he does inboxes, I kind of want to do something close. I, I bought a couple cases. I don't know where those are actually. I got to find out. I bought a couple sleeves yeah, for my games. Bag, but like, uh, I also don't have a power pad. I have uh, quite a few uh, NES accessories. Also, thanks to you guys, that fucking head mock, which I have to do a live stream with that thing. Because the last time I plugged it in, it was a... Uh, Operation Wolf, the game you guys got me too. Yeah, yeah. And and I put it on. So that works with all light gun games, right? That he's got the yeah. head mount, the head mount Yeah, it's thing it's gonna the, be ridiculous. Yeah. With the eyesight thing and then oh, yeah, fire, yeah. fire, and it shoots. But uh <laughs> I put it on and and uh it was like 
You were out of bullets, so everyone just killed me. I was like, what? What? I didn't even do anything. I, but I love it's on my shelf next to another NES and, and that box of cereal. Oh, uh, Mario. Yeah. yeah. Which, oh, great video about that. Join us, George. George, come sit. What's up? You guys on Turtle Time TV, probably. Uh, my BFF for life, my heterosexual but, uh, life partner. <laughs> <laughs> like Jay and Silent Bob. Oh, no, take oh man. What? No way. Look. Fucking mangled box. All right. Well, the next one I'm the next one I'm going to show is what I didn't realize when I oh, bought it when I picked it up. I, I guess I should have inspected dude. inspected it more, but feels bad at that. Yeah, yeah. Well, oh. we were we were talking about the next logical step from Whoa. um from Robotron, right? Perfectly though. Yes, from Robotron to this game to George sitting down next to me just perfectly that's perfect. Go ahead, it, go ahead, show it us. It is Smash TV, In, which I'm just noticing now. I, you know, I thought it was a, a box. Oh, I, mean, I guess. The top, look. Yeah, I mean, it's just like it's a cut, so it's just the whole box is just fucked. Yeah, we were we, we thought it was in box, but it's more half a box. <laughs> yeah, I'm but, I'm I mean, only collecting half box games now. Yeah, so but, it has a weird obsession. But Smash TV, you guys love this game. <laughs> yeah, you guys, you guys stream uh, on Turtle Time TV. Yeah, like and, like we said, uh, Robotron. Uh, we've beaten the game Jarvis. multiple times. I don't know if we ever beat it live though. No, we beat it the other day. Not the other day. I say that, but it was yeah. like a, probably like last month. Every time we we beat it, and we didn't every even time we try. Beat it, we're not live streaming. No, we didn't try. We just got drunk and we talked yeah. shit to each other the whole time, which would have made for the best stream because we were just like, yeah. He would like, I would like pick up a luggage, and he'd be like, "Dude, you're a fucking pussy." I'm like, "Hey, that's why you're, you died." He's like, "I wasn't paying attention because I was talking shit." I'm like, "Yeah, <laughs> fuck you, dude. Like, best well, non-stream we, stream ever." Yeah, we blew right through the game too. So right. Also talk about real quick how um, the control scheme works with the two. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's uh, so it's really just sweet, like Robotron. But... Uh, you move with the left stick and then shoot with but the right one. But when you play with the NES, you have to have a, a four Each player has a four two score. controllers, right? Yeah, you yeah. have to have a four score. So you have to have a four way adapter. Player one gets controller one and two. Player two gets controller three and four. And then, well, yeah, George will show you an example. Basically, you hold these, and, these and are, it's sideways too, which took me and George games. like forever to figure out. We yeah, played dude. Smash once, and we were like, "This game's stupid as shit." Yeah, we we're like, what you, the have hell? To, "You have to, you have to like hold, tap B and then shoot." And I was like, "This is stupid." But and then we, we looked at the box, and it was like double fisting action. Yeah, we're like, we're like what? This is, "That's funny, dude." Because like, we're, we're both, players, we were like, yeah, both, yeah, yeah, we were like yeah, getting yeah, drunk. We're, really fucking, we're like, <laughs> we're like, we're like getting is, drunk with two beers. We're like, "Yeah, we're already doing that." Like, what more do we have to do besides drink two beers at a time? Yeah, so we selected two player, four controllers, tried it out. Boom. And, and like, yeah, it you, became the funnest thing ever. You get ever. to do it like this with the D-pad, so it's like... And that's one of those games where George has to has to try to get me to play. You move with the left one. Like SMB3, right he's like, it's please, awesome. dude, can we play this once? And I'm like, nah, not today. He's like, please, Art, dude, like seriously, I don't ever ask you for anything. Let's play SMB3. But anyways, without further ado, I would like to show you guys Rad Racer. Obviously a very common game. Uh, one, of, uh, one of my top favorite games on well, NES. Well, look at it and honestly. absorb it, absorb it. $3. Yeah, $3. $3. Bucks. This is the kind of shit that I look for when I go to Disc Replay. Uh, if, if there's a game that's like one ninety nine or like $9, i am I'm buying it. I don't give a fuck what it is. Othello, I don't give a shit. I want to complete a collection and I play every game that I buy. So you're going to tell me like this game sucks because it's overproduced or something? I'm going to buy it and I'm going to play it and I'm going to complete this collection. So. Yeah. Red Racer is a very like relaxing, no stress game to just like zone out and play. It's it's really, really, yeah, yeah, for sure. If, if you do you need sort of uh, get a steering wheel for it? Maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Did, but, was there? I don't think there was ever. No, was there? I don't think there a was. Steering wheel. But was. also, I want to I want to note that uh, these little cases are really fucking clutch. This is this is nuts. Like, it's three dollars and they give you a case. That's intense to me. Keeps the dust off. What else you got, brother? I got which uh, another bummer, kind of honestly, but but still cool is I picked up Excite Bike. I'm trying to complete a the black entire box. black in? box collection. That's gonna be hard. But the thing is, this is 35 bucks, and this uh, the box. I mean, whatever. Did, did they put the sticker on the actual? Box? No. Well, this comes off, so that's cool. It comes off very easy. I just haven't taken it off. Okay. But the box is pretty mangled. That's beat up. The thing that sucks, so 35 bucks. I traveled around to a couple other tables and I seen it two times for 30 in like excellent condition after I bought it, which sucked. But no. yeah, but still, it's, it's not bad. You should have traded. I'm, I'm, yeah, traded. Brody was trading but, like crazy. He was trading up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he came back. He's like, I have five games now. I'm like, I don't know what you're doing, but you have way more money stacked up in your hand than you left with. 
He knows how to trade up. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, actually, I was going to say this one I kind of have to uh, shout out Philip for, but this is, I think one of the other games I borrowed f- from you is I borrowed Strider and I borrowed Rygar. Rygar is awesome. So, uh, this game's awesome. No, Strider's really fucking cool. And I have to, have to I, I got to double check my, uh, my Google spreadsheet because I think I had this game. But I, I looked at the cover for like 10 minutes. I go, I don't think I had this game. I don't think and it's also $3. Once again. Oh, you, that's only 3 bucks. Three bucks. Yeah, yeah. You think I'm going to pass that up, dude? Yep. Also, I'm going to have to buy a Rygar again. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You should pick Rygar up at one of these conventions sometime. Yeah, you should do that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Listen, you <laughs> no, take mine. <laughs> so maybe you need to. Can I have one? <laughs> Cool. Uh, my next pickup is Moon Patrol. There's a Yo. guy that there's a guy that has been at the last two conventions I've been to, and all, all his Atari box, box stuff, dude. Ten dollars each for all Look his Atari box, stuff, but though. yeah, dude, that is great. That is great condition. Yep. I say you frame that and put it above Moon Patrol. Yeah, good. At, at Twinkade, we oh, have shit. Moon Patrol. Yeah, no, you're you're doing this wrong. Hold this up. Look at that. Look at the dude. How old is this? You, you want me to guess? 1888? 80, 87. Yeah. Close. Uh, yeah. This is a... Well, here it goes. Williams, 1982 manufactured. So that's probably when the cabinet... The cabinet, right? yeah. So, yeah. like, look at the box here. If this box was made in 82 or 87, somebody left this in a case. Yeah, this yeah. is nuts, dude. And that's, $10. That's why it's so fun to collect for Atari, because it's so cheap. You were saying that earlier. Yeah. yeah, dude. Like, NES people... I mean, they're charging, like, 180 bucks for games yeah. out of box. You you can get every single Atari game for ten dollars almost. Mm. It's like guaranteed. Yeah. Yep. Ooh. Cool. Hit the microphone. Also, shout out Zach. I got this game because I was thinking about you and I needed to get this poster for free. And I pick it up and it's uh, Wayne Gretzky's hockey, right? Oh yeah. The guy you was know like. This game? Is that... No. Can um, we should we play it when we get home? Art. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. But Art just knows I love hockey is all. Also, I've been playing Zach, hockey so. my whole life, so. I love Zach like a ton. I've known him for like. 14 years but like we we're like on and off sometimes like i've known him for like 10 years and then like he would disappear for like two years and then i'd be like hey there's zach again at this random party no, wait. it's because I, like, I only really ever see you guys when i'm skateboarding yeah i was skateboarding really yeah no was you're right <laughs> but uh, yeah no skateboarding, I was this is apparently the this is apparently the canadian version is what the guy told me the guy oh, seemed pretty no, 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 yeah, the guy right. seemed pretty legit so i believed him and i was like it, I think it was only like ten bucks. And then was that the guy that played hockey with my dad or no? No, no. We, that would that would have been a story and a half. Yeah, that would be I bought a I bought a hockey game because Zach reminded me of this guy we met at the Midwest or not the the M O Game Con. I'm so fucked up. Yeah, whatever. But uh, yeah, he was like, "Yo, yeah, I played hockey with your dad." And I was like, "Yeah, what?" Really. So like, yeah, now this kind of came about because oh, of that. Sorry. I thought of that story and I seen this and I was like, "Yeah." I bet I bet you any money Zach would get a kick out of Wayne Gretzky game. Oh, yeah, great. I love Wayne Gretzky. I've seen Wayne Gretzky play twice. Fuck him. He played for the LA Kings at the time, which was pretty shitty. Ooh, I ooh. I almost bought that one out of box. Right after you did. But, uh, no, never mind. It was Star or something. Drink off this? Yeah, yeah. I just want to chase that mod. Hey, so my next pickup is a game that I played a shit ton when I was a kid. Like, Dang. most one of the most memories I have of playing any game is probably this game, Tag Team, Tag team Wrestling. Dude. Let me see. But um, it's a really quirky game, and it's really not really a good game. But I, I don't know if you fall in love with it, it becomes yeah. a good game. So I mean, every game is a good game if you really. I mean, I was a big wrestling fan when I was a kid, so I would always try to get my hands on wrestling games I was and ask stuff. You, but uh, the 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 weathering and the eighty on this box was that that's real though. Yeah, yeah, okay, for sure. Okay, I thought yeah. it was part of the art at first. Oh yeah, when yeah. I first saw it, like I mean, if you look at the front, if there's no glare on it, guys. There, there is a little bit of wear and tear on it. Yeah, but for sure. I don't know, man. Like, but it's very cheap. I, I actually, it was like nine bucks. So as like compared to Moon Patrol, I, I like this yeah, one more like because them. you get to see <laughs> yeah. the aging and shit oh, into yeah. it. Like, yeah. Gatorade, nobody it, it kind of guarantees <laughs> that it's not a, a reproduction box. Yeah, I don't so, mind conditions of boxes too much. Like, uh, you know, wear and tear. It's kind of cool looking yeah, and well, stickers stick and stuff like that. It doesn't bother me if they're like oh, it, from it, a cool it, store or whatever. EB Games and shit like that. No, if I get if I get an NES game with a fucking sticker on the label, like on, I'm like. First off, I can't see the label, the name of the game. Yeah. And then I have to peel Yo, this off. When I buy shit from Disc Replay, that's my sm- super most out. main issue ever is fucking, goddamn it, they have fucking stickers. <laughs> like, I bought uh, No More Heroes 1 and 2. 
Oh shit. Oh, this is my phone. Uh, anyways, I bought No More Heroes one and two, and uh, you were talking they about both have huge fucking stickers on them, and I try to rip them off, and then like you. Know, yeah, it doesn't work. Uh, uh, tell your story about the your dad. Uh, yeah, oh, let's let's get into that yeah, real quick. Remember that? that? Was uh, cool. I kind of got into it a little bit, but the Wayne Gretzky really. Re- I really don't know. I how saw it happen. I don't think it had anything to what do with this. What did you say? Though, well, like, what did you? Know, say? But it's just the- uh, yeah. I mentioned uh, well. Something some, hockey came up and I was just like, oh yeah, I played, I played hockey like you know pretty much. Line, we're five hours away from home too. Yeah, we're we're real far from. And uh, we're MO, bro. I was like, yo, you know, I I played hockey my whole life pretty much, you know. And he was like, oh. And I told him that uh, I played hockey here and there, and then I told him my dad played hockey for Mount Carmel, and he was just like, whoa. And he was like, oh, okay, well, cool. What's your dad's yeah. name? Yeah, yeah. Well, no, I didn't even say. Uh, well, I think I mentioned Chris Chelios' name at that, or Steve, Chris and Steve Chelios, both of them. Uh, and my dad played, used to play hockey with them. Like oh. he grew up with, he grew up with Steve Chelios, and he, Steve Chelios was on his team, and Chris Chelios, like they used to play hockey together. And um, I somehow got on the subject. I, I think Mount Carmel is what it was, yeah. Yeah, you said Mount and I was like, oh, and he was like, whoa, wait, wait, hold on a second. He asked me for my dad's name. It was uh, I told him Rusty Weaver, blah, blah blah. Rusty Shackleford. Yeah, Rusty Shackleford. Anyways, yeah, and he was just like, no fucking way. He goes, oh, I totally used to play. Because as soon as I mentioned that they used to play with Chris and Steve Chelios, and, uh, he was just like, oh, I'm, I'm pretty sure I know this guy. Yeah, I'm about to because I used to play hockey with him. And I told him, yeah, I told him my dad's name, and he was like, yeah, you. Uh... At a random gaming convention yeah, in, Missouri. Random, in Missouri. In Missouri. Out of all, yeah, out of all the things you could have done with. Chicago. Yeah, out of all the things you could have done in life, you know what I'm saying? You ended up going to this gaming convention. Selling fucking, uh, I think he was selling uh, NES games. He was selling NES games. That's yes. what he's doing, yeah. Which yeah. brings me back to where I was gonna go. Well, what uh, would be the chances of something like meeting my like, <laughs> rest yeah, area and seeing right. him like <laughs> kick a beer can <laughs> under his car? No, no, no. That's not. <laughs> we watched. We like. We happen, like looked but... over. Like you know. No, we didn't. But imagine like pulling into a rest stop and watching like one of your childhood heroes. <laughs> Yeah, you know, like like shotgun a beer in the parking lot, crush it, and then kick it under his truck, <laughs> and then watch the people who take care of the park pick the can up, like right. He's just like he saw him kick it, shirt all unbuttoned, and he's like taco meat hanging out. He was all just bare ass. He walked naked. right up over there. He's like, we gotta oh, cut this part. Psych. Well, that I mean, if that were to happen, anyway. Let's yeah, in the world of uh, yeah, possibilities. F- that even but anyways, uh, actually, I uh, am kind of a nerd about toys and vintage toys too. I don't know if you knew this, but, like, my dad has a bunch of trucks from the f- 50s and 60s. But, like, uh, here's this game called... It, first off, it's an LJN game. It's oh, going to be shit. Yeah. But it's a light, It's also a light gun game. It's called Gotcha. Gotcha was... It was a, gotcha was a, a, a toy line where they would make guns where... it look, I mean, you can see the cover. It's like, It was kind of like paintball. But they were making guns that were, like, realistic. And, uh... I'm I'm not gonna get into, I'm not gonna get too far into it, but like they pretty much had to like cancel the toy line, and then they I mean they already had this game out. They're like, yeah, the game's gonna help it. Didn't help shit. They're, everybody was like, we don't want these. This is fucking stupid. So it was probably like two three dollars, you know. But like I said, I'm 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 gonna buy every game that I that I can, and I'm going to play it. Like I'm not gonna buy a game to finish my collection. I'm gonna play every single game right now. Like there's gonna be a live stream probably in like a week. Or tonight. No, but I'm saying where we play some of these. And if some of these are on that we NES just, class. Yeah, stream any of those at- oh, dude, sick. I got a way. Oh. I got a way. I know people. I think Philip has ways. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure it's a gotcha movie. But. That was a total Trump face. <laughs> uh, uh, no, 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 let's see what you get. All right. Castlevania ah. 64. Never played this game. I've never heard anything great about it. I like I've never heard anything. You Someone it? cut out the fucking. Uh, oh, yeah, the cool. Ooh, that game is fucking great. It, it is good. Yeah, yeah it is. Game. Really cheap. Uh, actually, that game is trash. No, I mean, no, no, it's no fucking goddamn Symphonia. Got whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, it's yeah, it's fucking goddamn. It's yeah. a good game. It's fun. Yeah, yeah. When I was a kid, I mean, at least when you're like fucking nine years old, you'll love that shit. Well, I mean, you. Well, I thought tag team wrestling was good oh. when I was a kid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. Like you said, dude. Anyways, all, no, I was a kid though. All, I loved that game. It was all it was I'm gonna say is, uh, I fucking loved it. There's a reason all the Castlevania games went back to 2D. Yeah, 
Because the 3D was a really bad idea for Castlevania. I'm sorry, dude. Have you played this? Uh, yeah, I did. did actually, it? actually, no, I have not beat it. It's no, it just it doesn't work. It's just not. It's not there. You're right. It's not there. I mean, there's another Castlevania game for N64 too, and it's almost as bad. Did you guys hear the rumors? <laughs> uh, Simon Belmont. Maybe, I can't remember. Uh, I'm really drunk. A character in Smash Five. I heard that. Yeah. That game goes over there. Oh, I mean, oh, I oh, 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 everyone shut your face holes. This next one, I only got for $10, but this one's a fucking classic, dude. Oh, stop. My babe, Morgan. Uh, a boy in his blob. I mean, you probably know about this. Yeah, I know about that game a little bit. I never played the that version, but... What do you what versions you play? Uh, I think there's one on that I checked out for like five minutes on... We or something? Uh, I don't remember. Really? This seems like something that would be right up your alley. I'm the yeah, blob. I don't know. Just missed it. Never. The blob turns into like different objects that can help you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but this is like an iconic game though. Like yeah, for sure. Very iconic. Yep. But yeah, there's uh, I don't know too much about it. So once I play it a few times, prior to streaming it with George, I don't care if it's one player. I'm probably gonna stream it. We're probably gonna get drunk and play this game as we always do. Turtle Time TV on YouTube mm -hmm. and Instagram. Uh. One word. But yeah, here we go. David uh, Crane's uh, Boy in His Blob. This is, my, this is my last one. Show your next one. I also got too many games. Uh, Natalie, please don't be mad at me. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I brought... <laughs> <his mom>. <laughs> 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 well, uh, I got uh, a Tato game, which is... Tato makes good games, I'd say. But uh, Renegade, which apparently is like a prequel to... To uh, Double Dragon. But is it like official? Um, I don't know if the yeah maybe I think sort of official. But I like it. I can't remember. I, I believe, but yeah, it's a good game. Speaking of which, uh, at the convention, somebody had a booth with some drawings for a comic called I think uh, Street Fight or something close or like uh. <laughs> but it was like Final Fight mixed with Street Fighter. Oh yeah, where'd they have a comic book? I think it was coming. It was it was like that one one booth with the comics. Oh yeah, nice, uh, perfect. Segment. Oh, let me throw this. That is my last pick up. I got too many games. Is Double Dragon three. Whoa, yeah. perfect. I have one too. So me too. This, this completes. I don't the think we have three. Double Dragon collection. NES. Yeah, it's NES. Oh, yep. I didn't know there was a three. To be honest. For sure. How how did you not? There's a fucking battle toad Double Dragon. Yeah, I think that game's real expensive, maybe. That game apparently is like the best game ever made. Really? Yeah, People everybody like tells yeah. me it. And I, Josh always tells me, he's like, you didn't, you didn't, you've never beaten that game? I go, I'm going to tell you this like for the 40th time. I only have Battletoads. I don't have Battletoads Double Dragon. I have Double Dragon, one and two, and I have Battletoads. <laughs> yeah. And I'm not going to play Battletoads ever again because yeah. I watched Bootsy beat it on a... Uh, AVGN. Yeah, no, yeah. not gonna happen. But I guess yeah, this is gonna wrap it up. Uh, this is well. Speaking of AVGN, this is probably the reason I saw this. Uh, Rambo. <laughs> he did that. Yeah, he did it. Uh, there's a few stages where uh, it goes from like, I think top down to like side view, but it, Rambo is humongous with purple pants. <laughs> so like, I'm I can't wait to get the purple pants part. <laughs> Just like uh, with Jason Voorhees, <laughs> and he's wearing a he's like a purple jumpsuit. And and uh, when that new game came out where uh, where you where you're Jason and you get to hunt down the campers and oh, you're, you're yeah, three yeah. friends with the campers, they have an outfit in that where you, where he's purple, and he's got like the like the skin like the fucking weird beige colored mask. And I was like, no fucking way, they would even do this. Like they know it's so goofy. They were like, yeah, this is stupid. But I mean, yeah, that. Uh, right, yeah. So oh, whoa, 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 good whoa. haul, good haul. Like no, 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 grab that. Oh, dude. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't think this was ever in our live streams, but I have... Hey, hold this for me. I have the other poster that came with my NES. And I've, I, I... Let me get emotional real quick, can I? Oh, yeah. I'm three years old. More tears, the better. Gary, Indiana. I'm sleeping. I'm asleep and, and I wake up. I got my Yoshi. I have a sweater with Mario and Yoshi on it with sweatpants to match that say Yahoo on the top. Real big. Yahoo! Yahoo! Yo! And, uh... I wake up and like rub my eyes and shit. We go out. I get like toy trains. I got this owl clock. Like you, you could set the time on his stomach, and then you push his feet and it tells you what time it is, so you can learn time. And that's how I learned how to read time. I was like three years old. But the last present was an NES. 
and I remember getting uh, opening it, and there was a poster with it, and it's a uh, th- this is the uh, this is the other poster, which I should have bought the same one that I had. You know which one I'm talking about. Now you're playing with power, mm-hmm. and it's like breaking through, but I, I, this one obviously this is in, also in such great condition that I could not pass it up. The guy said, well, "What else are you buying?" I say, "I don't know yet." So he's like, "Buy buy a game, and I'll just throw the poster in for free." So I got this poster here. And I know, I don't know if you guys are huge NES heads like me, but, like, I, I, I like, seen it and I almost cried. I was like, this is nuts, <laughs> dude. The back tells you. I honestly you, love, love the dude, back. Like the, the back tells you, yeah, so this cool. came with your NES. This yeah, told you like, how to hook it up to your TV. If you had an antenna, you had to hook it up a different way than if you had the RGB or whatever. Uh, not red, green, blue, but uh, what is it? Uh, the, 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 RCA. Yeah, RCA. yeah, yeah. But, like, a. Uh, I mean, look at that, dude. This is in almost perfect condition, dude. I'm going to go to Michael's when we get home, and I'm getting this framed. Yeah, like, there's no right. doubt. This is a frameable piece of art to me. So, aside from the Castlevania Symphony, Symphony of the Night and uh, Zex, uh Conquer Bad Fur Day, this is like, this poster here is like the greatest thing that I purchased. I'm like crazy about this. Um, George probably you might be able to understand because you know how much I love NES but you probably do too this is like I opened it up and I was like mm, I have to have this I have to have this poster definite score dude, definitely frame totally, it totally dude it's getting framed yeah cool well that wraps up all our pickups had a great time at the show and yeah yeah man a couple more days left we're going to a party tomorrow oh, with everyone oh man every day is a party super here super fun but, but yeah Cool. I mean, that's side quest, man. Yep. We're going to keep uh, side quests until we find every game that we want. That's it. <laughs> All right, cool. So, yeah, that's it. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and we will see you in the next video. All right, later. Like and subscribe, y'all. Here's uh, my dick. Here's my penis. <laughs> <laughs> Do I point the- I like that? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. He talks. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cool. He's got a dick, please. Where's my dick, please?